Now if you want to get a game over after the timer runs out, we can do that simply by adding the event observer and adding the game over event. Of course, we also need to set up the UI screen to listen for game over event. And we can do that by adding the event observer in our UI. And if we rename it to game over, we'll see the game over UI jump here. And we can connect our game over screen here. Let's add a label and we can write try again. Add a navigation button and set it to restart. Let's go to our 3D world and set our time to be five seconds. Click play. As we can see that if the timer runs out, we get our game over screen, which says try again. And if we click on it, our game restarts. That's a quick setup with the timer. Now, if your game has multiple levels and you want to set a specific time for each of your level, what you can do is you can pin the time option and you can do that by going to options. And when the pin shows up here, click on it. Now that shows that it's pinned. We can remove our 3D models and also disable physics and use this cube as level config. And what you want to do is in every level that you create, so let's create level one, for instance, and we'll want to remove it from the start scene because start is a not a level. So in level one, now you can go and select the level config asset and you have the option of setting the timer. So we'll leave time at five for this one. And let's move our endpoint far enough so that the level two will not get loaded. And now let's add another level, level two. And in our level config, and let's set it to 15. Click preview. And now we can see that we start at level two as our timer starts at 15. And if we retry again, we can get the level one, which starts with five. So that's it for this video. So in this video, we demonstrated how to add a timer to your game and some options for configuring timers for levels. Hope you guys found this video useful. If you liked it, click on the like button. If you're not subscribed, subscribe to the channel. And until next time.